Wow, I think we've done really well for ourselves. This house is really coming along. Yeah, it's beautiful. It's, I'm really excited about it. Yeah, it's starting to feel a lot like being back home on Earth. We have mm -hmm. pleasant plants that we found, a nice bed that we made, and, and even a little kitchen nook. So yeah. we can cook food. This all feels almost too good to be true. Aww. Now, let's see. Now, in our couple of days of exploring and trying to build up our house, mm -hmm. we haven't really come across anything too much out of the ordinary. Uh, right. There's, you know, your average, uh, you know, your average uh, animals like chickens and sheep mm -hmm. and a lot of stuff that you see on Earth. But then there's, uh, I don't know, nothing really that's not like Earth. Uh, this is so much like Earth. I know. It's a lot like Earth besides the fact that there's just pouring magma out from the sides of the yeah, that's, that's, that's a little that different. There? Yeah, a lot of different lava sources, I guess. Instead of volcanoes, it just comes out like water would, which mm -hmm. is a little odd. But you know what? If that's the only bad thing about this planet, I think we can get ready to, I don't know, start building a communications tower and trying to reach Earth and let them know that we found a planet that could literally be Earth 2.0. That would be awesome. Do you think we can build it here or do you think... Um, I mean, we're pretty high up. Well, okay, well, we're only building a small colony. So basically what they wanted us to do was to come here and make sure it's Earth inhabitable, like make sure humans can live here. And right. since I feel like humans can, because we don't have helmets on anymore, we don't have air masks and, no, and we've been living here just here fine. No, and animals. Yeah, it's pretty much Earth 2.0. I feel like we can send a signal if we can figure out how to build a tower and get mm -hmm. communication with Earth and let them know the coordinates of where we are and tell them, hey, send the first batch of people and maybe they'll send, you know, a couple people, two or three, mm -hmm. and then after that, we can start a colony together with That'd everybody. That'd be awesome. Uh, okay, so let's actually, wait, do you see that down there? There's like, under that cave, there's like a little bit of light. Let me see. That's weird. I've never seen that before. Hmm. Do you want to head towards it? Why would there be light under a cave, though? I, we've only been the, the only people we've really seen since we've been here. We are the only people we've seen, the only other human or intelligent life, so how could light be under a dark cave? I don't know. We have the means to get there, so... Yeah, I guess we go. Let's 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 try to go see what it is. Uh, what do you think it could be? Um, Maybe more people, or... Uh, more people, though? Uh, space rocks. Space rocks? Yeah, space rocks that create the light. Uh, I don't know. This doesn't look, really look like we have a way down from here. We're gonna have to make some very, very cautious moves. I think there's some water down here. I don't mm -hmm. know if we can jump to it though. It looks a little dangerous. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Let's, let's see if there's another area over here. Well, if we can get down a little bit more, there is better right here, areas I for think jumping. We can jump from here. From right there? It could be crazy. Let me see. Uh, you could. We could try. Be very Why careful. Not? Okay, bye. Oh ah! god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna make it. Okay. 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 Here I come. Three, two, one. Oh god. Be careful. Oh my god. Ah, god. Okay. 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 I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know how we're gonna get back up there. We're gonna have a huge trek to get back up. This better be worth it. Whatever this is. I hope so. Okay. So stay to the waterbed because if it is something intelligent, we want to sneak up on them. We don't want they them to hear know us we're swimming? coming. No, no, we're swimming very stealth-like. Oh, okay. So that's our house mountain, so the cave was right over here. Mm-hmm. Let's get up on this side. Okay, so do you see the cave? No. I'm not sure which cave you're talking about, because there's quite a few over here. Oh, man, where was it? It was so easy to see from up there. Now it's so hard to see from down here. It was straight ahead mm. from the ladder. Which way was the ladders? Oh, no. Huh. It was right there. I swear there's the ladders were on the side. There's a lava pit. So if it's straight out from the ladders, then it means it's got to be this way. Yeah. Okay, so up here, I don't see any light. None in this cave. Damn. No, I think because whenever you look straight from the um, actual ladders, you see that lava, remember? So if we go straight from that lava, oh, which is over there. Right. Okay, lead the way, since you know the way. I see the light! It you is over this mountain, yes! I knew it would be over this way. Oh my god, and it looks like there's something over there. Like a chest or something. Let me see. And it's 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 a lantern under here. Under this cave, so someone I'm had to put it there. I'm almost to the top. I'm almost to the top. Look, wait, it's getting dark out. Oh no, we've never been outside at night. Uh, oh no, okay. Well, maybe we should make our way towards that light source and try to camp out over the night because there's no way we're making it back up there to go to our house tonight. Yeah, you're right. What is this? Oh, there's a little mole over here. Don't touch him. He could be dangerous. 
Okay, I won't touch him. Come this way. Let's go see what this light's all about. And at least this light will keep us safe at night, and we can build ourselves in if we have to. Mm-hmm. Oh, God, no. Watch out. There's a zombie over here. An earth zombie right behind you. Out. I have my sword out. Uh, oh. Eh, 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 eh. Die, 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 die. Okay, there, there we, we go. go. Whew. Okay, so let's go see. Okay, so it looks like this lantern was placed by somebody and can't just mm -hmm. spawn here. And then there's this chest. Should we open it? It's, um, it's not our chest. It's not our property. No, it doesn't hurt to peek what's inside of it. That doesn't yeah. mean we're going to take anything that's yeah, in it. Yeah, we're not going to take anything. Oh, the only thing in here is a book. Uh, hmm. Well, we're not going to take it. We're going to borrow it and... Should we read it? Yeah, I think we should check it out. Because if there's a book, that must mean there's intelligence. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what it says. Uh, beware the fall of the sun. When the sun goes, no one has any fun. When the shadows come, you better run, run, run. Beware of the fall of the sun. Uh, Wait, what? It was saying, the sun's beware fallen. of the fall of the sun. It said when the shadows come, you won't have any fun. So wait. I have so many questions. One, why should we be afraid of the dark? I know on Earth there's like zombies and skeletons and stuff like that. But, right. you know, that's all stuff we can handle, right? And I feel like a lot of other intelligent life could handle that. Mm -hmm. uh, and two, who wrote that? I haven't seen any intelligent life on this planet. We've been here a few days already. Yeah, and that sounds pretty intelligent to me. Yeah, it does. It's like almost like a riddle. It's kind of weird. And they said you better run, run, run when the sun falls. So they're basically saying you better not be outside when it's dark out. Otherwise, there's probably going to be some type but of price to pay. But we're already outside. You know what? I'm going to keep this book. It's not stealing. It's just I want to analyze this much more, but from the safety of our home. Uh, okay. I don't know if we're going to be able to get back up there, but we're going to have to start to make our way. Uh, be very careful. Be very right cautious. Now? Yes. Okay. Okay. Follow me. Just stay close and don't make any sudden moves. And if you see anything strange that you don't recognize from Earth, definitely don't engage it. Don't swing okay. your sword at it. Don't make any noises. Just try to be as still and quiet as possible. I okay. don't want to get hurt. Oh, God. Oh, There's... here's the, the blocks that we came from. Yeah, I know. The river's down there. We could make a jump. I'm going to try to make a jump. I'm making a okay. jump. Oh, make a jump. Okay, I made it. I'm in the river. Uh, I don't okay. see anything yet that that's alarming. I barely see any skeletons or zombies or anything. It's hard to see because it's so dark anyway. It is really dark. Uh, I'm looking at the sky. I don't see anything flying around that could kill us. And on all these, the only bad part is all these mountains and all these elevated hills. Things could be watching us from above, and we wouldn't even know. It'd be hard to get back. Uh, this waterfall is what we built our um. Remember going up this waterfall? Yeah, I do. Oh god, oh I see my it. there's a what is that over there? Is that Oh my god, do you see that? That's a that's a wolf or something. Do you see that across <gasps> the hill? What is that? I don't know. It looked like a person at first. I thought I was going crazy and then it turned into some There's a zombie werewolf. behind you. Oh no. god, oh god. Oh god, wait, do you see the other two things over there? Though like what are those? Those aren't skeletons. They're like they're like made of stone or something. It's hard to see. I don't know. I oh. want to go home. We have to get upstairs. We have to get back up now. Follow me, Megan. Let's go. Okay, Bert, read right here. To do list. Yeah, Step one, I, I, find oh. smart life forms. Step yeah. two, study the nightlife. Step three, make a ship to get back to Earth. Step four, make fun of Bert. Step five, create a permanent food solution. Okay. Per create a permanent food solution. And step six, don't die. Okay. You should follow that last one. <laughs> the scientists back on Earth gave us this mission. Okay, this is yeah, what we're here for. And if it wasn't for those life capsules and all those other capsules that we luckily have, we'd be pretty much screwed by now. I mean, think uh -huh. of all the meteors that hit our ship on the way here. We were dead a long time ago. Oh, it's weird to think. Exactly. But we're alive due to science, so it's okay. Wait, don't write it again. I didn't. Don't worry. Dang it. Okay, now look. What were we going to do? We have our room set up. Everything's set up. The, the, That's the, my room. The, I know that, Bert. The living situation is done. Now we just need to get to the next part of this. Studying life forms. Uh, does that make sense, Bert? Yes. When the sun sets today, we're going to go ahead and finish one of these to-do lists. We're going to study the nightlife. We haven't ever oh, had a chance right. to do it because we've been sleeping at night, but... Now we already found pretty it. smart life forms. I mean, these village-like no, people... I don't care about smart life. I want to know about the nightlife here, Bert. 
Oh. Like, what if this place does become near impossible to live in at night? We can't have that. So we need okay. to make sure that it's livable at night. So that's going to be our main goal for the day. In the meantime, right. uh, I did some work in the mine shaft today, uh, which was pretty nice. Um, but I may or may not have found something that I got to show you. What did you find? Maybe it's better I show you when we're a little closer to night. Because, uh... uh okay. I'm still trying to wrap my head around it a minute, and until I get my thoughts in place, I'd rather you not see it. You're going to cloud my judgment. What does that mean? Uh, it just means yeah, I need to think on my own sometimes. Uh, like right okay. now. Are we Are we leaving? Are we leaving the camp? Yeah. Okay. Bye, Larry! All right, I'm coming. Okay, yeah, Larry's still stuck underground, but that's okay. Larry's he's doing his He job. heard me. He heard me. I know he heard you. I didn't say he didn't. Oh, well, then why did you say it? Just to hear yourself speak? I mean, sure. Now, Bert, over here, we haven't really gone much. The uh, gun, gun diddly did much. The gun, we wow. haven't gone in, uh, We haven't gone out and done much. Uh, <laughs> You're stupid. We haven't gone out and done much yet as far as researching. Well, go, what is this? Where's what? Where are you? Huh? Some sort of fruit. Those are trees. Oh, you can't pick Oh, wait. They're not ripe yet. In the tree. They're not ripe oh, yet. Oh, yeah. No, those are probably unripened. Kind of looks like apples. Kind of, but I thought apples were red, even if they're unripe. No. I'm looking for anything out of the ordinary that we could possibly use to our advantage. Uh, uh this waterfall. <laughs> I missed it. Well, oh, oh, I made it. Oh, whoa, whoa, okay, it's just a zombie. It's uh, a zombie. be careful. It's just a zombie. I see some nightlife that's for some reason out. Bert, come here. What? What are those? They're moles. Those moles? They're moles. Oh, it's so creepy. Don't kill it. I gotcha! Leave yeah. it I just want to get some food. Oh, man, he's strong. Oh, cool. Look. Look there's one right here. Fur. Oh, he's running under. Oh. You got to get him. Get him. I got him. He's going to tell all his uh, friends. I got him. I got some fur. Maybe we can make some fur boots. I like fur boots. Well, we need more fur. We only Remember that song? Boots with the fur. The fur. The whole world is looking at her. Where's the sun? Oh, is it? Is it going down? It, I... Is it even I moving? I don't know. I don't know. The sun doesn't even look like it's moving. Well, just, the, the sun moves so slowly you wouldn't notice it moving anyway, dum-dum. On this planet, have you not looked at the sky on this planet? You can tell when it's moving on this planet. It, the daylight cycle is very fast. I can't tell, though. One sec. I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to go see. I just have to climb this mountain, Bert. Okay, have fun. I can't tell if it's moving. Look, let's get back to the camp real quick. Down the cave we go. Okay, so if we go down the cave, as you can see, I've done quite a bit of mining. Wait! What? I'm just hungry. I'm good now. Okay, come down here, and then when you get to the, down to where I am, take a left. Take a right. Yeah, the right's a dead end. It already caved in on me. When I was mining out this cave, I found, well, a chest. Okay. And in the chest, there was a book. Ooh, a book! Yeah, not the type of book you're thinking. Oh, here's what it said. Light is your friend, darkness is your enemy, dread is the dark, where the shadows come out to bark. What? I don't know, read it! That's what I was saying! It doesn't make any Sounds sense! Sounds like a stupid poem. Light is your friend, darkness is your enemy, dread is the dark, where the shadows come out to bark. I told you. I can't believe they rhymed dark with bark. I mean, that is just, that is just awful. It is pitiful, I know. Come on. Let's just get back, bring that back with us. Oh, oh, sorry. I just put it back in the chest. I thought maybe that's where it belonged. Well, yeah, but let's bring it back with us. Maybe we can analyze it for fingerprints it or something. It could be cursed. Oh, don't come right. It could be cursed. You're right, but let's bring it back and analyze it and find out. All right, all right. We need to figure out basically everything there is to know about that thing. Cause it's like it's warning us about something, something in the dark at night. See, and that's why like a cave. Caves are dark. No, but it, I think it means more night, Bert. If we go out at night, then we'll be fine. We'll go out at night, figure out what this danger is, so then we can figure out, you know, how actually bad. Cause for all we know, the person who wrote that just didn't have any weapons or or genes that could make him, you know, strong and beat these things. Oh, it's nighttime. Genes, like. Oh, watch out! Skeleton! Pants? Skeleton! Ah! Inside! Get inside! Get inside! Eh! I'm gonna put the, the thing in here. I'm killing it. I'm killing it. I'm killing well, it. Be careful. Oh, he almost shot Larry. He's dead. 
Look how close you got from to Larry. That's fine. Come on, bro. We gotta go stay the nightlife now. Dude, you gotta be more careful. You gotta be more careful. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to Larry. I don't care who you're talking to. Come on. I thought Larry was the one underground. Well, I named them both Larry, all right? They both have the name Larry? Huh, I mean, sure. Why not? Larry with white shirt and Larry with brown shirt. They don't seem to change clothes often. Bert, there's a person. What? Over there, look! A person! What the heck? Hey! Hello? That's probably just one of those villagers. Be careful! It, it, it oh, is geez. just a villager. But they're... They're all torn up. Hey, don't hit them! Or I her! Was just, I was trying to see... What who, are you? I don't know. They're not we, saying this much. This person's kind of giving me the creeps. Yeah, they're not saying... I, maybe they're an exiled villager? I don't know. None of them even freaking talk. I know, but like, I, I don't know. Do you see anything? Watch out. Uh, what? No, it's fine. The, Ignore it. What? Bind you, bind you, bind you. Uh huh? I don't see anything. Oh my gosh! Hey! Don't shoot my friend! What the heck is that?